Hi, this is Johnny. Uh, I have a video request by a viewer asking that instead of using this dun uh, PVP dongle to make this one, this one play with each other, uh, I I'm going to be using this uh, this cable that I bought for the Tango Eco Mini Two, which is uh, C to C. And I'm going to go ahead and plug this cable to uh, port number one. It say it doesn't matter which port that you plug into. Now it's kind of weird when I just plug it in, it turned black on me, the screen. So last time it doesn't matter when you plug it in, you know. Let me turn it back on and plug it in again. Okay, so I'm going to plug those two in, and then I'm going to... some reason, uh, it's not coming up. Power is on. Okay, I'm going to see if it come up first. Make sure the power is on. Okay, I'm gonna plug this in now. Somehow it, it triggers something on this machine. Because this is uh, a 100 watt power cable. So when I unplug it, it came back up. So I guess to answer that question is, can you use a direct cable C to C to make this work? It doesn't look like it will allow that. So let me try plugging into the other direction. Uh, plug into one. See, you get the screen go crazy. It doesn't allow it. It won't work, okay? All right, the second video that uh, I wanted to uh, update you guys is I did. So this will not work by plugging the cable in. It will just make the system go black. And I don't know, it only happened to this side. It didn't happen with this side. So let's see if I plug in. The next topic I will be talking about is Neo Geo. I have... Neo Geo 163 ROM that you don't have to run a batch file and all the hack and all the uh, Asian uh, game that require like understanding the language. Okay, now this is plug in. I'm gonna plug in this one. See if it do the same. Okay, this is weird, kind of weird. Now both of them is okay. It's not freaking out. So I don't know if there's something malfunction with this one or not. I'm not sure. All right, I'm gonna choose the first one. And let's see if it allow me to do the uh, you know, multiplayer. So it go directly to the game. It did not give me the option to to select the you know the, the double mode. It's not allowing me to do that. All right, let's see if we could just start the game and it would allow me have to play or not. Okay. Yeah, it's a totally different game. It's not allowing me to have two player. All right, let's turn that off. And let's put the micro SD card in this time. They both have Neo Geo. One of them have 100. This one is the one have 100, 163. So I'll be releasing that one on the, below the video link. So that those of you who doesn't want to run, run the batch file, just want a one single uh, SD card, not SD card, but one uh, Neo Geo. Uh, now the only, I will talk about when we get there, let's finish this test. 
All right. I turn both of them on the same time. So let's see. Oop, sorry about that. I don't know. Okay, so far so good. It's not doing the. Now let's try to run the hack version and see if we could play two player with uh, just the cable. Now I plug in the same direction the first time we were having some issue when I plug it in it went crazy but now it seems like it's okay now. Do I recommend do uh do this test? I don't know this thing is giving out power where it will cause problem because this is a data cable and also it it allow you to charge 100 watts or 60 watts so this is a 60 watts cable all right so i don't know that uh, this is the one that have multi game so i need to find one that i could play two player in here so i have metal slot one let's try metal slot two let me see if I have, I have metal slot for sure. Now here, the, the one that I'm giving you, 163, it do not have the uh, same one showdown uh, perfect. Uh, 5X, it does not have same one showdown 5X or same one showdown So this is the other game that it will play. Now there is at the end there is one that uh that require both ROM to run. Without without it, it will not run. It's like a double same game, but it require each other in order to play it. Alright, let's try this one, mail slot two. Now I took the metal slot 2x out also because uh, because it won't run in uh, I don't think it will run on this system. Yeah, they are one player. So the cable do not work for you have not you we know the dongle did not work either with the hacking. So so pretty much is giving that since the first part did not work, the stock game did not work. So the hack game will not work either. Okay. So let's get out of the game. Alright. So enough of the cable. So I have the Neo Geo 164 game here, listed here. And so you're gonna have Metal Slot 3X, where this one going to have Metal Slot Turbo, which is 2X, okay? So the game here work if you separate them, but you're not gonna have Samurai Showdown, perfect. So let's go see Samurai. So you got Samurai Showdown 5. You get this down to that same location. So you got Samurai Showdown Hack and 4 and... But this one, you, you're only going to have Samurai Showdown 4 and 5. But no 5 Perfect, no 5X, no none of those, okay? Uh, because it doesn't load when you put them all together. Then the last game, uh, you're gonna have two version of it. I think he's still in the back. Yeah, this one, Top Hunter, 
hack and top and hunter okay you're gonna have both of them you need both of them in order for this to work i'll fix the box on so you will see will display the box on uh i mean the the box saw and the title now without if you delete this one this one not work if you delete this one this one will not work so you need both of them in order to work another work okay and that's the one this is the one game that have to have uh, two file in order for it to work which is kind of weird And for some reason, I forgot that game in this in this hack on this one, the one that you want to bash for. I don't think I have this game Top Hunter. For some reason, I did not have it. I don't know why. But yeah, Top Hunter. I think I, I don't know. I thought I saw it. Maybe I have to run the bash for. It's not on this one. I probably have to run the bash for. But yeah, this one, 140, 40, 163 will be available on the download link. So you could download this one. And I'm working on the, the RK. Um, I think I'm on the... Let me take a look. I'm on the F. I started with almost 600 game. The, the one, the like, most popular one. And now... I'm on the F. I already got 200 working. So I have F to J left that I need to test. So once that is finished, I will also be uh, giving you that one set. And I'll do a, video, a separate video on that because I'm still working on it. And I'm doing like different alphabet per day. So I could get it done testing all of them. Uh, what's funny is most of the game, uh, half of the game do not work. It's not because it didn't load. It's just the screen is upside down or vertically, not vertically, horizontal, upside down. It's not playing, it's not, it's not displaying in the correct direction. And this screen does not turn. So you get game that, that is in the wrong direction of the screen. So those is not playable. Now I do get one or two that is have lacking. And so I remove those two as well. And uh, I think I'll provide you guys the list of the game that I tested that did not work. So you could search the game list and see uh, which one do not work. I did create a bash file and uh, the one set of alphabet is already working. So it's not going to show up here because the list, the 500, you're going to have to like do this 500 times. So the one that was working from A to, uh, I guess, A to J, those got already got moved into another folder. It's, it's, it's in another folder. And then this here, uh, the one here you see, you see those do work. And the one that do not work is already been removed and deleted. So all the one here does work up to uh, up to F. So those all this game here does work. So I just want to let you uh, see it real quick. And uh, I'm working on the F right now. So those shooting game does work, and this one does work. And like I say, the one that is real lack. Those I have removed. Now this one require this one. Here's another game that require each other. If you delete one of those, the other one will not work. Okay. And so this one work. And so I'm up to, I think I'm up to here. Yeah, right here. I haven't test this one yet. So the way I test it is I actually go in and play play the game, make sure the controller and, joy and the button work. Because sometimes the game will load, but the control and button do, do not work. It do, it do not work. You cannot play. Like, this one is dead. This one do not work. Oh, it does work. <laughs> Low slope. 
Okay. So this one worked. So, and then I'm go down. I got a computer next to me. So I go to the next list. Then I need to insert star. Press the A button. Make sure that I can move the controller. And the second button is working as well. So yes, this one is, does work. And so we're gonna keep it in our list. And the one that do not will be uh, deleted. Now, I almost stopped doing this ROM set. And the reason is because uh, Neo, I just call him Neo. He, uh, he on his channel, he, uh, he did a Happy New Year's uh, surprise video. And they have PlayStation, PC Engine, CD, and Sega CD working. And also some of the arcade that is hard to emulate, like Ninja Turtle in time. It doesn't work here, but he demo it and work on his. And, and, uh, and I know, I went and downloaded this exact seven game that he have. Some of them, I think half of them seven game, it does work, but it's very slow and lacking. So, so it make me realize that they, he is not using the, he's not using the, uh, the same hack that we're using. He's using a retro art. And uh, the last time I talked to him, he, he they say they're working on retro art to get, trying to see if we get get it to work. Now it looks like a lot of game is very promising. It does low, but I don't know what is gonna be the front end. Uh, the, I don't know which front end they're gonna be using. I hope they will use the Neo Geo Arcade Stick front end because I love the idea that I could create an animation right in front of it. That is is real cool. So I hope that they will create that because uh, those you could do a lot of changes to it, the artwork, the design, the pictures, you know, and I really like that. And uh, I actually bought another Neo Geo arcade stick that I haven't opened yet. So I'll be probably do a, a video about open it and update the 20 game to 40 game because it's come with a 40 game. So I'll be doing that pretty uh, shortly. Uh, on that once I finish this arcade test game so this one should be working I played this last time I think this game is already in uh, this game is already in uh, yeah Capcom so those two need to be removed because it's part of uh, Capcom so we already have it in Capcom so I'm, I'm hoping now, I already put the Capcom with Neo Geo 163 game, and they do not work together because Neo Geo refused to work with Capcom. Now, I'm hoping that this 200, 300 plus game will work with Capcom. If it's going to be 300 game, then probably will not work together because too much game, too much artwork, and so lack of resource on this hack, it won't work. So that is a possibility that this game will have to be on its own SD card. So I've been writing on my SD card the name of the game like this. Let me turn this one off. Like I, I actually write the name. Like this is Neo Geo 220, 69 and 175 game in here. Okay, 64K. And then that one is RK. And then this one I wrote down... Uh, Neo Geo 163. Now, just let you guys know, if you buy one of this uh, thing that I was referring to you, uh, this one will not work, okay? When you plug it in, it will give you power, but if you, let me demonstrate it real quick. I was thinking about, now, I'm getting another one is coming like in, in three days that you have to plug a power in, okay? And maybe that will make this work. But if if this one do not have a power, it just by itself. And then when you press it down, it turns the power on. Okay. Now what I find now is if you plug this in, okay, and you you turn it on and turn it off, 
it doesn't recognize the SD card. I was hoping it will, so that way I could have, you know, one SD card here, one SD card here, and then turn this one off, you know, turn this one off, and then just play this one and then say, oh, this is Neo Geo. And then if I don't want to play that, I switch to this one. So let me demonstrate that real quick. Let me just unplug this so I don't confuse you guys. So I have this one, just one of them, and I go in, and I get blank screen, see? Nothing. Nothing. So this this hub will not work with this machine. So don't waste your money. I already bought two of them. <laughs> I already bought two of them thinking that, okay, I'm going to have one over here and then one over here. And then uh, I could, you know, have different games on here. Five games, four games. It's only four hub. And uh, apparently do not work. So I went and ordered a one of them, a single one that you have to plug the power in. And then we, we go, I'm going to test it again, see if that work. So this is some of the update, just know you know. I know I suggest this, but this do not work, okay? So I just I bring a lot of different topics. Hopefully you guys will see it. Otherwise, you guys are going to miss it because I cover both the hub, uh, the Neo Geo, the new Neo Geo, and then the cable that someone asked me to test. And so by testing it, it do not work. So you have to use the dongle. Okay, so if I unplug this, and hey, I'm curious, this is still on. I'm going to plug this in and see if it, see if it work without turning it off. <laughs> Probably going to mess up my SD card. Okay, now it still doesn't work, so you still have to reboot it. So apparently it does not see it, maybe because it do not have the power, so it, it doesn't see the the... I call it SD card. It actually is a flash drive. I apologize. Don't mean to confuse guys. Flash drive. Flash drive hub. USB hub. Okay. So the flash drive, it does not see the flash drive. And But if you plug it directly in, it, it will see it. But for some reason, it do not see that game. All right. The next video, when I, when I do the RK, I'm going to cover the trackball and the spinner. I'm going to use the my... Uh, glance on uh, spinner and trackball see if it, if this thing recognizes a spinner and trackball with the hack I know the retro art does support the uh, they was doing a demo it support the light gun shooting which is kind of, that's pretty cool but uh, I don't know do they work with trackball or spinner but I don't have the same version that they are testing they're using retro art I'm just using the first hack that they feel comfortable to release it so that's the reason uh, you are seeing what I'm seeing is that's the first hack that they came up with. It's like they did with Neo Geo Arcade Stick long time ago, it's like two years ago, if you guys remember. When they first came out with one hack, it was so hard to figure out what is the ROM naming and this and that to make it work. And once we got it working, they totally changed the, the they try to make it easier so you don't have to we move the underscore and all that stuff and then I have to redo the whole thing to make it work which I did and